Good evening, dreamers of all ages. Welcome to our cozy corner of the world where stories come to life. I'm Tobias and with me is Niklas and together we are the brothers that brings you the Magic Bedtime Stories podcast. Every night is a new adventure here and we are thrilled to have you with us. And let's not forget Ida, our clever AI friend, who makes every story special. Ida, what's in store for us tonight? Hello everyone. I thought I'd start us off with a laugh. Here's a joke for you. Have you guys heard the story about the headless robot? Uh, no. According to reports, he completely lost his mind. <laughs> Good one, Ida. It's always great to start with a laugh. Now, let's dive into today's fascinating facts. Ida, what's our topic for today? Today's facts are all about continents. And did you know, we're broadcasting from Sweden, which is part of the continent of Europe. That's right, and there is so much to learn about each continent. Ida, can you print out those facts for us? Printing now. Get ready to explore the continents. Okay, here we have it, fresh off the printer. Let's jump into these interesting facts about our continents. A continent is a big part of Earth with many countries and people living there. Continents have different names, shapes, colors and weather. There are seven continents on Earth, Africa, Asia, Europe, North America, South America, Oceania and Antarctica. Africa has the most countries. There are 56 countries in Africa. Africa also has the most kinds of animals. You can find lions, elephants, giraffes, zebras, and many more. Africa has the longest river in the world too, called the Nile. Asia is the biggest continent in both size and the number of people who live there. Almost 4 billion people live in Asia. That's more than half of all the people on Earth. Asia also has the tallest mountain in the world called Mount Everest. Oceania is a continent made up of many small islands in the Pacific Ocean. One of the biggest countries is Australia, where many fun animals live, like kangaroos, koalas and platypuses. Europe is the continent where we in Sweden live. Europe has many different countries that are close to each other and often have the same rules and money. Europe also has many famous buildings and artworks like the Eiffel Tower, Big Ben and the Mona Lisa. Thank you, Aida. That was some uh, really interesting facts about continents. Now, speaking of adventures, we have a very special story request from one of our young listeners. That's right, Tobias. We received a wonderful wish from a boy named Adam. He is from Melbourne and he has a great sense of humor. Yeah, he writes this. Hi, Niklas and Tobias. I am Adam and I am six years old. I really love funny stories. Can you make up a story about a kangaroo who is a chef, a polar bear who loves to dance and a talking pineapple? I think it would be super funny. What a creative and hilarious idea, Adam. Let's see if Ida can do this with this fun-filled story request. Spot on, Niklas. Now let's print out the story. Gather around, everyone. The story is guaranteed to bring out the giggles. Let's begin Adam's Whimsical World Adventure. Once upon a time, in a world where every sunrise brought a new wonder, there lived a kangaroo named Chef Joey. Chef Joey wasn't just any ordinary kangaroo. He was known far and wide for his culinary magic. With a hop and a skip, he could turn the simplest ingredients into a feast that tickled the taste buds and filled the heart with joy. His kitchen, nestled in the heart of a lush green forest, was a place of delightful aromas and colorful dishes. Not far from Chef Joey's kitchen, in the icy realms of the north, 
where the snow sparkled like diamonds under the moonlight, danced Bella, the polar bear. Bella had a love for dance that made even the northern lights seem dim in comparison. With every graceful twirl and leap, she wove a spell of beauty and joy. Her dance was like a flowing river, smooth and mesmerizing, and it was Said that the stars themselves would pass to watch her. In this world of wonders, there was also a talking pineapple named Pete. Pete was not just wise, but he was also the master of jokes and riddles. His laughter was like a melody that echoed through the forests and over the mountains, spreading cheer wherever it went. Pete lived on a sun-kissed island where the sand was soft and the waves sang lullabies. One sunny day, Chef Joey received a mysterious letter sealed with a wax stamp that bore the image of a star. The letter was an invitation to a grand feast in honor of the Queen of the Night, a rare flower that bloomed only once every hundred years. The catch? The feast had to be prepared using the most unusual ingredients found in their world. Excited about this grand challenge, Chef Joey knew he needed the help of his friends. He set off to find Bella, the dancing polar bear, and Pete, the wise and witty pineapple. As they gathered, the air buzzed with excitement and possibilities. Together, they embarked on a journey across their magical world. From the deepest valleys where giggling mushrooms grew, to the highest peaks where the clouds tasted like candy, their adventure was filled with laughter and discoveries. But little did they know, their journey was about to take an unexpected turn. In the heart of the enchanted forest, they stumbled upon a hidden path, leading to a part of their world they had never seen before. As the first rays of dawn kissed the sky, Chef Joey, Bella and Pete found themselves on the mysterious path in the enchanted forest. The path was lined with trees that whispered secrets of old and flowers that sang soft melodies. Our friends were filled with a mix of excitement and curiosity as they ventured deeper into this unknown land. Their first discovery was the laughing lily pond where the water shimmered with a thousand colors and the lilies chuckled at their own reflections. Chef Joey carefully collected the sparkling water, knowing it would add a magical touch to the feast. Next, they stumbled upon a grove of dancing apples. These apples swayed and twirled to a rhythm only they could hear. And Bella, with her love for dance, was enchanted. She joined their dance, and in return, the apples offered themselves for the grand feast. As the day turned to evening, Pete's keen eyes spotted a hidden cave behind a waterfall. Inside the cave, they found the rare moonberries, glowing softly in the dim light. These berries were known to taste like dreams and starlight a perfect ingredient for their magical feast. But their adventure was not without challenges. A riddle guarded bridge, which only Pete could solve, and a steep climb up the whispering peaks where Chef Joey's strength and Bella's agility were put to the test. Each obstacle brought them closer together, weaving their friendship into a stronger bond. As they gathered the last of their magical ingredients, the trio realized they had ventured into the realm of the dream weavers, mystical creatures who crafted dreams. The dream weavers, impressed by the courage and heart of our friends, offered them a final gift, the essence of joy, a rare ingredient that would ensure the queen of the night's feast was unforgettable. With their basket full of wonders, the trio made their way back. The feast was a spectacular success, with dishes that sparkled with magic and flavors that told tales of their adventure. Chef Joey's culinary skills, Bella's graceful dance, 
and Pete's witty riddles enchanted everyone, including the Queen of the Night, who bloomed in full glory, filling the air with a fragrance of happiness and wonder. As the night came to a close, Chef Joey, Bella, and Pete looked up at the stars, their hearts full of joy and memories of an adventure that brought them closer than ever. They realized that it was their unique talents and friendship that made their journey magical. What a great story that was. Aida, you have outdone yourself. I'm here to spark imagination and joy. May your dreams be as cozy and delightful as tonight's story. Good night. Thanks for joining us for another magical bedtime story. Dream of kangaroos in chef hats and dancing beers tonight. Good night. Sleep well. <laughs>